What's going on, guys? Welcome to Vlogs here, and welcome to Super Reese Galaxy Audiobook Part 36. So last time we left off on the part where Pinnell and Clearwater were about to have a meeting. So with that all said and done, let's go ahead and get started. Super Reese Galaxy Part 36. Pinnell, Clearwater, you said you wanted to have a meeting with me? Clearwater, ah, yes, Pinnell. I have been waiting for you. For way too long. Pinnell, did I do something wrong? Clearwater, did you do some? Did you do something wrong? You done messed up, boy. Pinnell, what I did? Clearwater, it's what did I do? Pinnell, I knew that. Clearwater, as you know, your job was to run the college scheme as promised. You know, the Ponzi scheme that we got trapped in because of all the debt. All we had to do was have 13 people go through eight planets, spend two weeks in each planet, and have all your students sit for a final exam in the castle by the end of, the, end of September. And if they would have all passed, then we would have gotten all the money that we owe the boss. King Potato would have been in charge of funding the school, and we would be able to escape this job. But you blew it. It is now January, and who knows where those kids are. Let me ask you this, Pinnell. The boss asked you to microchip them. How did that go? Pinnell. I microchipped all of them, but I thought the microchips wouldn't activate until someone jumped on Neptune. And no one did. Clearwater. Well, Pinnell, the boss won't be happy with you. Pinnell. Why are we doing this again? Clearwater, I don't know why I'm telling you this, but let me walk you through the story for the billionth time. The boss hired me to be his business partner, and then he wanted things to be his way, so he was my boss. Then I found you. We all wanted to run a business to where we made money by doing very little. I decided I'd have you work for me. <sighs> Your job was to be the dean of the college. Now, this is a real college. We didn't create the Galaxy College. Then, you hired Largo. Professor Largo gathered 13 people and gave them a speech about cars and told them they could make $20,000 a month, but they would have to go to a special college. Your job was to ensure that the students were staying interested in the program and see who could really make it. You did good when you told Largo not to have students sitting on their butts learning trigonometry. However, you didn't do things in a timely manner. But now, can you explain that part? Clearwater, each planet was supposed to take two weeks, but there were various planets that took four to seven weeks each for the group to complete. My point is, you weren't fast enough, and you haven't done what you are supposed to do with the kids. Pinnell, can you clarify what was actually supposed to happen to the students? Clearwater, as you know, Reese's Lady Carolyn was involved with the scheme. She has information that would destroy us if anyone found out. Pinnell, everyone keeps beating around the bush about what's really going on. Can you tell me what is really going on before you explain the whole Carolyn thing? Clearwater, here's what was supposed to happen and what we we are still trying to do. So anyway, I know this part was really, really short, but, you know, this week, you know, I got really, really backed up with everything. But we are going to finish everything for the Pinnell and Clearwater meeting. And then uh, we're going to talk about how the group gets to Planet 10, which is where Pinnell and Clearwater are at. It's that whole thing. It's that last planet where it's all merged together. It'll be the final planet, and soon enough we'll be, like, making the lesson videos for Planet 10, and we're going to be having the final exam, and eventually Super Reese will come out. But anyway, it's Largo Vlogs, and I'll see you guys next time.